Hey guys, what's going on? Today is um, Wednesday, September 9th, 2009. It's 999, and I'm back in New York. Um, you might not recognize this backdrop behind me, but um, this is just another wall that you're not used to seeing. I'm usually on that side of the room, which I'll just show you. See where the TV is? That's where my desk used to be, and you used to see that part of the apartment. I just moved some things around. Nick and I both decided it was time for changes all around. And um, yeah, so just mix it up a little bit. So yeah, I'm back from my vacation. Uh, it was fantastic. I had the best time while I was uh, abroad in Spain. And it was just everything that I needed. And I... I, I've got to travel more. I can't believe I'm saying that. I, I just, just because it's not the me that I've known. Uh, I've always been such a New Yorker and, you know, I remember several times where I've taken my vacation time and stayed in New York and just relaxed and, you know, it was nice, but now that I travel a little bit more, I just realize what opportunities there are out there to see other things and and, and I want to do that, so, um, yeah. Tomorrow is September uh, 10th. It's the start of Fashion Week in New York City. And uh, for me, that means a whirlwind at work. It's an exciting time in New York. It's a lot of fun. And I, I'm just gonna try to stay positive <laughs> about it. Um, you know, while I was in uh, Spain, I met a lot of interesting people. And not one person talks about their job. Nobody. And of course I asked questions. I wanted to know what people did. And it was just, it was, it was an interesting thing for me to kind of see people who don't view themselves in, in the parameters of what they do for a living. And maybe that's just something we really tend to do in America. Um, and certainly something that we do in New York. They don't see their job as defining anything about them other than what they do, you know, to make money, to fund their life. And that's, that's a very liberating concept to me. And, you know, I'm always late to the game, but it's something that I want to adopt more of. I don't want to go through my life thinking about, you know, work and identifying myself by what I do because that's not who I am. And that doesn't have to determine the kind of life I'm going to have. So it is definitely fall. Um, I went outside earlier today, I went to the grocery store and I had to come back in and get a hoodie because it was just so crisp and breezy and lovely. I absolutely love autumn. So I'm excited that that's here. Um, it's also fall because all the shows are coming back on TV and the new shows are starting. I'm a huge fan of Glee. It's on tonight and I can't wait to, to watch it. If anyone is, is enjoying this new show Glee, you should check out Popular, which was from the same creator, Ryan Murphy. It was on the WB about 10 years ago. And I've talked about this show before. Um, it was just this over the top, campy, full out, gay, um, just a hysterical, dark comedy um, set in high school, and it was about the popular mean girl world of high school. I actually watched um, a bunch of those old episodes of Popular while I was in Madrid on my, like, I had like a five hour layover, and um, when I was coming back, and I just watched one episode after the other, and I forgot how hysterical the show was, so I highly encourage any Glee fans to check out Popular on DVD. Nick and I are heading to Chicago this week. Uh, this weekend, actually, a friend of his is getting married. And um, I'm excited because it's a big Jewish wedding and I've never been to one of those before. So can't wait for people to yell L'chaim and to, you know, stamp on the glasses and hoist people up in chairs. And I'm so excited to, to go see all of that. So everything is going well and uh, it's good to be back in New York. Um, I'm on YouTube. I am I'm waiting for people to make videos. I feel like 
there's not a lot of people out there who, who have much to say. And, you know, everyone that I'm subscribed to, you, you know that I watch you and, and I hope you come back. Um, you know, we all have to come back at some point and, and, and I'm here. To be honest, YouTube is not the same to me anymore. It's just, it's changed the climate, the, the type of videos that people make, and the reason that people are making videos has changed. In the beginning, we had people like Happy Slip and even William Sled and, you know, just all these people who were creative and doing interesting stuff. And then people started to get like, you know, YouTube partnership and sponsorship deals and everything just changed. And I'm not criticizing, you know, doing something different with your channels because I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest even even what I am kind of sharing here is starting to change a little bit I think and I used to never really engage people in what they thought and and now I'm kind of more interested in a dialogue hearing what other people have to say and I think a lot of that just comes out of wishing there was a little bit more contact going on 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 YouTube it's not that way anymore and and the people who are here it feels like so many of them are just like trying to be cute and make, you know, their little TV shows out of their channels and uh, well, I'm going to stop talking now because I could, you know, piss a bunch of people off. But um, if, if you're watching and, and if you never made videos, start. Just make it a, a project. Let's see. I, I would like to see, you know, more from all of you. So. Girl.